So I've been talking to some people over the last couple of days, uh, some of our Pinpoint Local partners, and um, I noticed something that, that comes up and it's, it's, it's nothing new. It's something that I see, have seen regularly, but um, just something that came home to me this week. Um, and that there's often a substantial element of frustration um, among people because we're learning something new. And I just want to talk about the learning process and about frustration for a minute. Um, and it just came home to me because I'm trying to learn something new this week myself and that frustration came into it. Um, so the thing about learning is, right, when we start to learn anything new, right, first of all, it's extremely hard at the beginning, right? It's really hard to get your head around stuff. Um, but, but you do your best, right? And then after a while, you get to a point where it's extremely frustrating, right? And that frustration, you know, you think you should be doing it by now, but you're not able to do it and stuff is going wrong and all that kind of thing. And it's really, really difficult. But then as you get through that frustration, you figure things out and it becomes like a really beautiful thing at the end, right? I've actually learned something. That's great. Okay. And so that frustration is actually part of the learning process. And so for me this week, um, I've, I've changed my exercise routine. I've never been in a gym before, but I've decided that I, I, I want to do some gym work. So I've been asked somebody to show me how to use weights and that kind of thing. And I completely get things wrong all the time. So I do that and I'm finding it very frustrating. But when I find something frustrating like that, I'm aware that that's part of the learning process. And so it doesn't really bother me that, that much. In fact, when I start to feel that frustration, I say to myself, you know what, if you're feeling the frustration now, you're probably pretty close to getting it right. So, you know, I'm supposed to be breathing a certain way and I'm breathing the opposite way and, you know, and I get the weights wrong and all that kind of stuff. But um, that frustration is going to lead to the new learning, which is going to be great. And I know that I'm close to it now. And so it's a pity that we don't know about this learning process before we start to learn something, because it would make things so much easier and we wouldn't give up as often as we do. So I encourage you just to keep that in mind that the learning process is going to be difficult at the beginning. It's going to get frustrating in the middle, but then it's actually going to be great when it's finished. We should learn this stuff in school. I really wish we did, but we don't. And so let me give you an example then of um, somebody I was speaking to this week um, who has been working at Pinpoint Local and trying to make sales since the very beginning uh, back in April. And, uh, and she's been frustrated and things have been really difficult and things haven't worked out. But she's been learning, right? And all of a sudden then, over the last few weeks, she's closed six website deals, right? So six website deals is huge because coming on from them is SEO and various other different packages that are, that are being upsold. So that is the start of her business taking off. And what's happened is it was really hard for her at the beginning, um, you know, to, to, to make contact with potential uh, clients, to go to meetings, all that kind of stuff. And then it got really frustrating and she was at the point of giving up. And then all of a sudden things started to fall into place and she realized, okay, actually, you know what? I have learned something here and this is working for me, okay? So just try and remember that when you're feeling frustrated, that it is part of the process and that you're coming through it and you're going to learn something and it's gonna be great.